Hello everyone, how are you all doing today? Today I'm going to change my battery. I bought another one, so I'm going to get rid of this one. I'm going to put the other battery here. So first of all, I'm going to remove this battery. Next, I'm going to unscrew the screws. And over here, I've got this adapter that I bought online. So this is the adapter. So this is how it looks like without anything, without any adapters or anything. So I just have to make sure that it's tight, not too tight, but just tight enough. And here's the battery holder for the new battery, the new larger capacity battery. So now I'm just gonna screw this here. This is ready now. Now all, all I have to do is connect the cables. So for now, my plan is to do this. Like whenever I want to change the battery, I'll just do this. I'll connect this battery here. And then whenever I want to use this one, I'll just do this again. Now I'm going to lock the battery. So yeah, now I've got two large capacity batteries and I did a little test and I get approximately 27 miles range on these batteries. So 27 and 27, now I'm gonna get 54 miles range. And yeah, it's not bad. But of course, I'm also going to mount the other battery, uh, the Ryan Plus battery, over here. I'll do that another day, but yeah, for now, this is all right. And the reason why I'm not going to do it today is because I don't have the adapter. I need to get another adapter as well. So yeah, within the next few days, I'm going to mount this battery over here. This is gonna go underneath here. And then I got a long cable. So that I can connect it here to the bike. So once I have this battery connected, I will have in total approximately 27, 27, 54 plus I would say 18 with this one. 54 and 18, 72, so approximately 72 miles, and yeah, that, that should be plenty. Alright, so it's now very, very cold, but I'm still going to remove this battery. <clears throat> so yeah, um, there's the adapter. So this is the adapter. I got one screw here 
Ang una lift is on MT Ah, uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna put one screw here and one screw on top So I bought this adapter to connect the batteries to the bike and that's an XT60 connector and I got an extension here and then an XT90 connector on this side and the battery comes with an XT90 connector so I just have to connect it straight to this adapter and that's how I connected the batteries to the bike. I'm also going to get a box and mount it here on the rear rack so I'm gonna get rid of this bag and I have like a proper delivery box and I'm also going to change the brakes so I'm going to get um, hydraulic actuated disc brakes and there's the front of the box and Inside the top box, I got a backpack with some bits and pieces, extra jackets and things like that, and a drink. And this is how it looks like when it's empty. So this top box is very easy to remove. All I have to do is unscrew this. Unscrew it, uh, just remove it, and that's it. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I'm also going to get a new camera. I'm waiting to see if the iPhone 14 Pro is going to be, uh, it's going to have like proper good cameras. If the iPhone 14 Pro Max has got like really good cameras, then I'll get an iPhone. If not, if it's not that good, then I'll get a mirrorless camera, probably a Sony mirrorless camera. So yeah, next month I'm definitely getting a new camera. <laughs> I won't be using this phone anymore. I mean, I'll use the phone, but I won't use the cameras. So yeah, that's all for today. Until next time, see you guys later. Bye.